Hey guys, welcome back to our YouTube channel. It's a girl Fanny Lungu back with another reaction video. If you're new to this channel, make sure to give this video a thumbs up, share it with your friends, and of course, do not forget to subscribe. A big shout out to the person that suggested this. Today, I'm going to be today I'm going to be reacting to the Holy Prophet Muhammad's letter to the monks of Saint Catherine in Mount Sinai. So without wasting time, let's get into the video. The Patriarch then sent us to the depths of the Sinai Desert, to a Greek Orthodox monastery where early Christians also sought protection. It's called St. Catherine's, and it's located at the foot of Mount Sinai, where according to tradition, Moses received the Ten Commandments. It's the oldest functioning monastery anywhere. There are 25 monks here today, servicing the smallest diocese in the world. The monks are all Greek, with one exception. Altogether, we have 3,300 manuscripts. The chief librarian, overseeing an incomparable collection of ancient manuscripts, is Father Justin. But most of these date from the 10th to the 14th century. A converted Baptist from El Paso, Texas. He showed us the monastery's collection of Byzantine icons, the largest and oldest collection in the world. Then he took us to what the Patriarch really wanted us to see, a little-known letter written by the Prophet Muhammad almost 1,400 years ago, signed and sealed with his handprint, offering protection and religious freedom to the Christians of the monastery. These are precedents from Muhammad himself for toleration and peace among people of differing faiths. The Patriarch then brought us back to the 21st century and Turkey to his own backyard. He took us for a ride on an island off of Istanbul in a carriage with a police escort. The Patriarch wanted to show us that Muhammad's message of tolerance has not been received by the Turkish authorities. His prime example the Halki School of Theology, the only Greek Orthodox seminary in Turkey, empty and abandoned, no priests, no prayers.
an interesting video um muhammad is preaching that we should exist in this world even despite believing in different religions which is good but are we doing that no or not many people out there or on this um platform are ready to insult anyone that doesn't believe in the religion why are you insulting someone because they believe in a different religion than you i think that's um that's quite barbaric that's being savage for nothing and you end nothing by insulting someone who believes in a different faith um from you it makes no sense it won't get you anything and the person will move on in life and enjoy their life whether you like it or not another thing i've noted is they're talking about how uh secularism in turkey is going and how certain things have been banished or not being practiced anymore i'm wondering so it's like it's like this video is one-sided they don't they're not for this secular reason that's being practiced in turkey what do you think should be the governing law in turkey do you want it to be the sharia law i'm just curious because when you watch this and see what they're writing you'd think that's what they want i'm just i'd love to be clear on that if not being secular then what i think i think personally i think uh being secular is fine you allow people to do as they please you allow different things to to coexist in um a community and people should mind their own business if they want islam let it be islam if they want christianity let be let it be christianity if they want to believe in nothing let it be nothing i believe uh, a secular nation allows all those things a secular nation um allows certain things to be done than otherwise um feel free to give your own opinion this is mine and i'll be more than glad to read what you have to say otherwise someone's opinion is not wrong your opinion will not be wrong because you said something under my um video just like this person's opinion in this video is not wrong that's what they believe that's how they feel that's what they've seen and they've put it in a video for us to watch otherwise let me know what you guys think make sure to give this video a thumbs up share it with your friends and of course don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you in my next reaction video